Yes, yes, we have. And and I think investors love to see the traction. They love to see that we bootstrap this product from two people, $4,000 total invested in the company from ourselves to getting to mm -hmm. profitability with great traction, great product, and users that obviously love us. So we kind of compel them to take that meeting with us, even if in the back of their brains, they initially thought this is just a fitness company. Right, and this is uh, you know, one of the challenges as founders, isn't it, Brian? You, know, you, you come into a space, the well's been poisoned, or there's a lot of you know, um, shrapnel and a lot of body parts laying around, it's pretty gruesome, mm -hmm. all these zombie companies, it's the graveyard of startups, all these fitness apps, all these photo apps, all these dating apps, all these on-demand companies have failed. And you're into, in the space and having success. Right. And you now have to convince investors that all of the carcasses along the road that they see of dead startups, yeah. they should ignore because, hey, when you get over this hill, that's where the promised land is and we're ready. So I'll, I'll tell you exactly what I do because I'm living this right now, right? With so I, I, I have a, it's a social video app, make videos with people. It's, I'm not the first person to do this. Three years ago, there was a wave of these. Vine. So, uh, well, even besides, but, so Vine wasn't still collaborative. Vitty. It was, it was all these jump cam, weave. Uh, oh, yes. Facebook had an app called Riff. Right. right. There were, I'd say, 30 of these things that were popular. Some got 3 million in funding, some got more, and a whole bunch of them were out there. They all went through incubators. Some of the incubators, like the Disney one, doesn't, doesn't exist anymore. So I just take this head on. I put a slide in my deck that says, this, is, this has been tried. I'm not the first one. So either you already know these companies, and I'm confirming what you already know, and I'm showing that I'm not afraid of this information, or you've never heard of any of these companies. You go, oh, my God, this guy's done his research. He's right. listed you're, 30 you're of these credibility. things. And he's shown all the money they've raised. Then I go and I explain, here's the one thing all of them did that was wrong. None of them realizes what doomed them. I'm doing the opposite. Right. Now let me show you how this works. And in this case, it's a tool that you can export, the, I'm guessing here, but it's the ability no, it's, to put it on any platform. No, I don't, I don't, you don't force everybody else to download an app. Ah, so that's really it. That's we're, doing, we're doing this really heavy lifting hard thing. Yeah, so if somebody everybody posts else, a video, I can reply to the video correct. without the app, so it's, right. it's fluid. But the point is, like FitBod, right? This, is a, this, this has been tried before. Right. And you're going to have that skepticism right off the bat. Yeah. So just dive straight into that. Slide one. I'm not the first person to do this but I'm doing it better. They all did it wrong. Here's how they did it wrong. Here's what we're doing right. Hey everybody, I'm super excited about our latest partner on This Week in Startups. It's called Cisco Spark. From Cisco, you know Cisco, of course you know Cisco. Cisco Spark is a new meeting platform and a communication platform for teams. And we're using it here at This Week in Startups and it is life changing. It can make working together so easy, so pleasant. And in this package, for one low price of free, you get, yes, that's right, free, you get video meetings, team messaging, like chat, you know how that works, digital whiteboarding, I'm going to get into that in a minute, file sharing and calling, all of this together in one secure app that works on any of your devices, Android, tablet, iPad, iPhone, desktop, you get the idea. And it's the fastest way to host and join meetings, and it works with industry-leading video systems like Ah, yes, the Cisco Spark Board. I have the Cisco Spark Board, and this is a touch-based, all-in-one device where literally I click and I say, everybody who's in this room, you know, like a chat room, everybody in this Cisco Spark room, I want you to join this video conference. Somebody could be at home, another person could be in a hotel or on the road, on their phone, on the BART. Two people could be in a New York office, two people could be in the San Francisco office. All of a sudden, we're all in one space, on the Cisco Spark board with all of our files from that chat room. And we can then pick an image like we did for the launch festival and start drawing on it and saying, hey, let's move these tables here. It is amazing. And the Cisco Spark board comes in 55 inches or 70 inches. It's kind of like an all-in-one touchscreen whiteboard camera with amazing microphones where if you're in the back of the room, it picks you up perfectly. And the video quality, it makes you feel like you're in the same room without having to spend what used to be, I think, a quarter million dollars or $50,000 to outfit a room. You can now do it for low thousands of dollars. It's pretty amazing. Uh, I love my Cisco Spark Board. And on this very program, This Week in Startups, we're going to start putting Cisco Spark Boards in other cities so that entrepreneurs and investors from, say, New York, Los Angeles, maybe London, Berlin, uh, Hong Kong, Tokyo, Seoul, can then video conference into the show. And we can start doing remotes with startups from around the world. 
How exciting is that? All powered by Cisco Spark and the Cisco Spark board. If you want to see all this exciting stuff and try the software, go to ciscospark.com, ciscospark.com to learn more and sign up for free. Thanks for joining the team, Cisco. Let's get back to this amazing program. Mm-hmm.